In this video, we'll be completing mole conversions involving gases. These gases will be at conditions of standard, temperature, and pressure, or at STP. How much space do you think one mole of a gas takes up? Well, it takes up about this much space. So a standard beach ball has about 22.4 liters of air inside. It doesn't necessarily seem like that would be the case, um, but, but it's actually pretty close. Of course, you may be saying to yourself, well, doesn't that depend on the pressure and the temperature and other factors as well? Yeah, it, it does. Um, that's why we're going to define standard temperature and pressure. Here are the conditions. Standard temperature will be zero degrees Celsius. Standard pressure will be one atmosphere. Now we're going to learn um, what an atmosphere is later in the year. Um, but an atmosphere is about the pressure that we're under right now. So it's about room pressure. So you can think about STP being like, I don't know, similar to conditions outside on a cold day. So you should probably um, write this down or memorize it probably. At standard temperature and pressure, one mole of any gas has a volume of 22.4 liters. So at STP, one mole of any gas will take up this much space. Even if you have a combination of gases like air, if you mix nitrogen and oxygen together and you have one mole of that mixture, it will still take up 22.4 liters of space. Let's practice a simple conversion. How much space would 3.5 moles of nitrogen gas at STP occupy? Now this shouldn't be too hard. Start with your given. And you have a conversion factor. You know that one mole of nitrogen takes up 22.4 liters. So if one mole takes up 22.4 liters, 3.5 moles should take up 3.5 um, times that. So it's, it's, it's a fairly simple problem. Notice two sig figs here, three sig figs here. That leaves us with a number uh, with two sig figs. So 3.5 moles of nitrogen gas would take up 78 liters of space.